Okay, I'm going to show you what I'm doing. I picked this cage because it has this fine mesh on it. And this is the pen that these chickens were in. Every time I ever left a chicken with her babies in here, you can see this one. I don't know if it's dead or alive. Oh, it's dead. It ain't moving. And there's a few more. So I'm going to take this chicken and put it in here with their babies. I don't know how many's in there, but I did hear one. Hopefully it didn't jump down already. Oh, I see the baby moving. I see the baby moving. So I'm gonna put it in here so I know that the babies don't fall in this pen. And then, you know what it is? And the babies can't get water and all that, so that's what I'm doing. Moving on to that. And the kids are sleeping. And I got a long sleeve shirt on, so and she goes to bite me. I'm not sure I thought there was another baby in here. I'm gonna put this, these eggs in here. This baby. And you'd say, why don't I open it up? You don't open them up because if they're not ready, it'll rip their skin off them and they'll end up dying. I gotta put this down. I can't hold it. So that's what I'm going to do. There's the baby there. I don't know if you can see. It's trying to break through the shell. And then I'm going to take some of her eggs and put it in there with her. Her in here. She turned it over. She's a 
upset because I moved her. But if I didn't, every baby that was born in this pen died. So I moved her before they all got hatched because if I waited any longer, the babies would be dead. And I'm going to put some food and water with a shallow bowl in here so that the babies, when they're born, they can drink from it and they can wash themselves with it. And that's what's going on.